happy Thursday. So I just wanted to go over a few things. Yesterday, I looked at everyone's sketches that were submitted, and we talked about engaging dynamic um, compositions. And so if you weren't happy with your composition, if things were dead center, we need to avoid that. These were the things we talked about. We must show practice by doing sketches, inquiry, which is research, essential questions, having diverse questions, ideas, and anything about your topic. And then we're trying to think of interesting and unusual compositions. I don't want to see the same type of um, point of view with every single art piece because I'll be bored, the judges will be bored. We also want to have artwork that shows a connection that makes us feel something, okay? Um, I have a couple of students that are late and I'll deal with them later. I just wanted to let you know that this is class time. Your assignment number eight will be due on Monday for the critique, which will be 50 points. So if you have any questions, if you need any assistance, I'll be here. This is class time for you. If you turned in your sketches late for that proof of practice, let me know so that I can help you um, and give you points. I'm about to load those on Aries. So, you know, the sooner you get that done, the better. I have already posted uh, the assignment number eight so that you are able to go on and put your sketches and everything like that, okay? So that's really important. Let me go ahead and show you where that's at. It's under assignments, should be anyways, yes. And I'm gonna make a couple of notes on here, there for you. So critique is Monday. Monday only. All right. Um, that's 50 points. You must have four sketches with notes. You must have your EQs that you're exploring with that art piece. They should be changing. And inquiry. Inquiry means research, guys. Sketches and notes means practice, which is what the judges are grading you on. And then, you know, we're going to be showing them um, by the feedback will help you with further revisions and exploration because they want to see exploration. They want to see it evolve. So I'm going to put in parentheses evolve. I'm giving you the answers to the test here. But if you don't do these things, then it's no wonder if you don't pass the exam. All right. So that's what it's all about. Sorry it took so long to type that out. Um, I'm here for any questions, anything you may need. I don't read minds. I, I had several students show up to um, student support yesterday, and, you know, they got one-on-one -on -one time. But remember, we have all this amazing class time here. We're here to learn from each other. I bet you're not the only one with questions or assistance. Let's use this time wisely. Um, otherwise, I'm going to do my own thing. I'm on the clock right now. I'm here for you. So. Let's get this magic done. Assignments one through seven should be posted on the AP exam with all the ingredients. If you needed me to look at your um, autobiography so we can do more edits there, like, come on, I wanna help you do this. I want you to pass. Everybody's paragraph should be posted. Special studies, just cause you don't have to post your stuff. That doesn't mean that you shouldn't be improving your artworks to raise them between 90 to 100, okay? Any questions for the good of the group? All right. I'll go ahead and stop this video.